Hey everyone, I'm Jackie Moran and welcome into my stylish journey here with you on the mile. This is my 12 part live stream series. We are here talking fall fashion of, on, of course, on our new favorite app, The Mile, where it's the new app that allows you to shop your favorite brands from your favorite influencers and creators right here all in one place. And what my show does on The Mile is I like to bring you my love for affordable fashion meets high fashion right here all in one place. So as I see our guests are joining, I see Ignacio, I see Guest 101, uh, give me a shout out. The best thing about talking fashion with you guys here on The Mile is that, yes, I'm doing it uh, every Thursday, 3 p.m. Eastern time for the next 12 episodes, but also you get a chance to chat with me live and we can talk together about fashion, whether you're shopping, watching, or getting inspired, maybe to create your own e-commerce store. Because the other thing that you can do here on The Mile is you don't have to be me, you can be you and do what you love. If you love shopping and you love fashion, then you can actually take this opportunity to join The Mile. So to all my influencers out there, if you wanna start creating your own content on The Mile, you can do that. You can become an ambassador and you can basically create your own e-commerce store with the fashions that you love. So take that opportunity to check that out and explore in more detail if you like the sound of that. Now, if you like the sound of fall fashion, and maybe as a New Yorker, because I'm a New Yorker, getting ready for my fall fashion, maybe you're wondering, what are those fresh wardrobe staples that I'm going to need in my closet this season? Maybe you don't need a lot. Maybe you just need one new piece to pep you up for fall, like all these pieces behind me do for me. They just get me pepped and amped for fall fashion. I'm gonna show you some amazing pieces that you're gonna love, whether you wanna go for a few of them or one of them, or just take home some style inspo. So don't forget here on The Mile, you can discover these new products with me or at your own leisure. You can save your favorites, you can get personalized recommendations, uh, of course, based on your style preferences. And during the show, all of the products that I feature, they are available for purchase. So if you see on your uh, mobile device, you see that little arrow, you can click to shop the products as we are talking here live. It's on your right hand side if you're watching on a desktop. And also, most importantly, guys, don't forget code Jackie20 for 20% off anything you purchase on the show and even beyond. If you purchase something from the show and then you get excited, and you shop some even some more things. If you are if you include a purchase from this show, you're gonna get 20% off your purchase with code Jackie20. So don't forget that one. It's available for all of these 12 episodes for my fall live stream series here on the mile. Now let's get into it. I see JM is so excited to see my picks. Well, I'm so excited to share them with you on this ultimate shopping destination for anyone who loves fashion. I'm raising my hand for that. Okay, can we talk about my love for fall, winter, summer, white, ivory, you name anything creamy. The more we get into fall and winter, in fact, the more I feel I need the creamy and the ivory tones. I'll never forget, one of my cousins actually showed up to our holiday Christmas dinner in an all white look, just like this with a coat over her shoulders in cream also. And it was such an amazing layered style. So you can do white and ivory all year round. I see JM says, love your outfit. Karen's giving me the smiley face. Kim is saying, so you can wear white after Labor Day. Yes, Kim, please keep putting that forth to everyone out there who might still have that fear. You don't have to have that fear anymore. Jenny is saying, looking gorge. So guys, yes. You can wear white all year round. There's different ways to wear it. This is that rib knit, sweater knit, ivory winter white that we have going on for fall right here, right now. It's all about two piece set because this is a two piece look. You buy them separately. So whether you wanna go for one or the other, I am all about the rib knit two piece right now. I actually just wore something similar on another photo shoot this week in bright pink but I'm loving the mock neck. I'm loving these, look at these gorgeous gold buttons that you have going on right there. The cut of this tank is amazing. So even if you rock this tank with something super simple like this jean, which I'm gonna show you as a major fall staple crop jean right here from Splendid, these separates, uh, so just 
start to picture it. We're going to build a look with just this uh, coming up, guys. But if you are into these separates, these ivory white separates, also note they're by Solid and Stripe. You can shop them 20% off. I'm rocking small and small. It comes extra small through extra large. The brand Solid and Stripe, they are two separates here. Ribbed, gold button detail that I'm loving. All of this fun stuff. The comfy waistband. Gotta love a good stretchy waistband on the skirt. One little tip that I have for you is if, you should see how small this looks when you take this little top out of its package. If you want to have a little bit more room and a little bit more flow and fall on the body and you don't want it too clingy, you can size up. So where I'm a small, I could actually even rock the medium in both of these pieces. Sometimes I even buy my rib knit tops in large because there's just, it's just going to hug you no matter what you do. So you don't want it to start getting too off size, but you can size up if you want it to fit a little bit more comfortably. So check these out right now if you want to shop them. But of course, I want to show you how to style this and amp it up, right? So that's what we like to do here. We like to give you that style inspo. Don't forget 20% off with code Jackie20. If you want to just make that little false statement with an under 100 accessory right here, I've got the most petite under 100 accessory pair of earrings from Splendid. These are the huggy hoop. So say hello to the micro hoop, if you will. We see micro bags behind me. Now we have micro hoops. The huggy hoop is having a major moment. This is your, I like to liken it to as if you were wearing a pair of studs. This is the modern version of studs right here. I'm seeing them on every influencer. If you want to know what their go-to grab-and-go earring is going to be, it is going to be the huggy hoop. And these are from Splendid. I did mention they are gold-plated. They're 0.5 inches, just to give you a sense of the size ratio there. But guys, guess what? use code Jackie20, these will be under $50. So go check these out if you want to get that easy piece. And I know it seems like such a little statement, but these little statements for everyday wardrobe staples for this season and beyond go such a long way. So check those out. I see so many guests are joining and watching. Guest 301, guest 341. I love it. Whether you have a name or a number, I'm welcoming you here on our style chat. So these are an under 100 find that you will absolutely wear more than you even know for fall because they could be athleisure casual, they could be dressy, they could be even event worthy dressy and they look really rich and luxe in that gold vermeil plated finish. So super simple to add some polish to any look and I like to always add a little edge. So I like to live on the edge. Not really, I'm actually pretty boring, but my fashion is not boring. And I really love a good booty, right? A good ankle booty. I started to open my series with a taste of that last week. It was a shooty booty. Now we're going full booty. And I am gonna take it off because I actually want you to see so comfortable, such an easy zip, beautiful white leather. These actually come in ivory is white they come in ivory and they also come in black as well as some other colors they actually come in brown and green army green as well all trending colors but this is a true pointed toe mid height ankle boot right here that's just under three inches so it is an everyday wearable boot i actually size down a half size in these these are by shoots and they also by the way come to under 150 with my discount jackie 20 so uh check these out for true genuine cow leather right here such a beautiful crafted boot that actually looks good on the ankle doesn't swallow you and look too huge because truth be told when you get to size 10 Thankfully, that actually narrows a lot of my shoe buying because you start to look giant in size 10. Now, I am in a nine and a half in these, and they are still super flattering on the ankle. They would go with your crop jeans, uh, with your skinny, uh, any kind of skinny jeans that you would do, your leather leggings, all that good stuff. That's why I love the good mid heel height on these and just the perfect shaft height to genuine leather from shoots. Now, by the way, I don't want to forget to mention, I want to go back to my outfit too, as, in terms of color choices. It actually comes in red, which is having a major fall trend moment if you do want that pop of color and also black. If you want to go from that go to, I always like to call it that New York 
chic black basic look nothing but anything but basic in black that would do the trick in black as well so if you want if you're worried about it flattering your figure of course we know black is always so flattering so this does come in red and black as well so there are color choices going on for all of my looks so much mixing and matching to do from the tank to the skirt to the boots to the hoops we are already so set for fall in just a few of these first pieces here. And I see, is it Liana? I can't read sometimes, guys. I think it's Liana saying, I love it. Well, I'm so glad that you love it, but I have so much more to go. Can we take a moment? Can we take a moment for Lux and have a Lux fashion moment right here? This is the most Lux piece of my fall wardrobe staples. But as I see Karina joining us, can we share the love for an amazing leather jacket for fall? The leather moto jacket has just had its place in fall fashion nearly what feels like forever now. And this one, oh my God, that jacket, Karina, I feel your energy through the phone right now. I feel what you're putting down. I'm picking it up and I am going to put all of it into trying on this amazing i mean i'm literally when i get struck in love by fashion this is that moment yes it is asking 695 for this croc embossed leather jacket but think about the discount code think about the moment that that just made when we put it on our shoulders and it just feels so luxe and so fresh and so chic. Do some math on that. I know my brother calls it fashion math. Uh, you're getting nearly $140 off if you do splurge on this. Charlotte's saying, amazing, I need that. Diego's joining. Jenny's saying, love, love, love that. Uh, girl math, you've got to love it. It does the trick for us, and it makes us just appreciate and understand our purchasing and why we do it. And I love girl math. Let's just do it. Fashion math, girl math, I'm for it. Elisa is saying that outfit all together. See what happens when we just add fall layers. It's so much fun to add chic layers for fall and they're super basic, but it just looks so elevated. So there's something I want to shout out. It's called the quiet luxury trend where it's like those basic neutrals, but chic and modern, and they just look expensive. Uh, sometimes they are splurges and they are a little bit more luxe. And sometimes you're going under 150, under 100. But whichever way you put it all together, it just gives off that chic, fresh, clean, understated, but modern vibe. This is giving all of that look right here. And I'm going to add even one more layer with a little bit more croc embossed look here from Anine Bing. This little mini top handle bag will go with just about every fall outfit, whether you go for this actual one or just use it to inspire your go-to fall mini bag. I, you've seen me talk about these bags. I'm probably gonna have eat one in each episode. A great mini bag goes a long way. You need the tote and you need the mini bag. JM is saying I'm drooling over that jacket. Charlotte's saying she's my favorite. Karina's saying love the outfit. Oh, guys, thank you for bringing the fashion love on this Thursday at 3 p.m. on the mile. I love the fashion love. That's why we do this. And I think Charlotte is saying I need all new bags. Yeah, sometimes you, when it's, the seasons change, sometimes you just feel you need those fashion updates. That's what, that's what this episode is all about, giving you those fashion updates. Jenny's saying yes to the bag. So let's talk about it. It's got that really pretty gold lock clutch. And uh, just so you know, or hinge really, I should say, it, it mirrors even off of that huggy hoop vibe that I was talking about earlier in the show. Those are under 50 with the code Jackie20. But even picture this bag right here from Anine Bing, $100 off with code Jackie20. So if you do invest in any of these luxury pieces, accessories, toppers, bags, those style stamps in your outfit, those are worth the splurge. In my opinion, from me to you, if you're going to splurge, do it on the piece that gives you the mileage in your closet. Do it on a great leather jacket. Do it on that handbag that you're going to hold. And Charlotte's saying timeless uh, early Christmas present, question mark. Yes, I'm always for an early Christmas present. I'm also for shopping gifts for yourself because that's also fair. So throw it out there, Charlotte. I like it. Keep giving me these ideas. Uh, but this is that perfect little boxy bag, which also has that croc embossed finish. Now, uh, just so you know, I'm going to pop it open. There is, and I didn't even unwrap it. There is a shoulder strap too. 
So if you want to do it as that shoulder crossbody, of course, you can throw that on as a crossbody to any look. So can we go back to my love for this jacket for a moment? Because I'm going to show you now, you're seeing how great this vibe is. Just even these two accessories together to finish off an outfit. Can we go back to the jean now? Picture the top with the jean, with the jacket, with the bag. This is me when I try to look super stylish for a day of styling on a set or somewhere where I need to be casual but chic and polished. Here's the go-to fall Jackie Love look right here. And any of you can rock it. It's just, I'm not putting my own name on it. I want all of you to own this look too. That crisp tank, polished crop jean, and the amazing moto and the little croco bag. It just all adds that touch of luck. So if you're looking for a fall style staple jean, Splendid has some really amazing ones on the mile. I like that this is a very clean denim. It's not got holes all over it. It's a very clean, crisp, solid, cropped denim stovepipe jean. It comes sizes 23 through 31, uh, 178, but do some math on that. Add the 20% off. This is that ode to a true classic denim wash. And they even say booty friendly in the description, true blue, high waist. So a good clean jean is all you need to go a very long way in your casual look for fall. I still, I, I always say I'm really not a pants wearer. If you notice, I'm kind of always in something skirted or dress related. But if I am going to own a couple of great pairs of jeans, I actually don't even care whether they're luxe or less. I, I'm so picky about jeans. If they make it into my closet, you know they're a good worthwhile classic denim right here with the high waist and the crop cut. And Charlotte's saying, love the color. Yeah, the wash is just perfect, Charlotte. So good point on that. Fernando, Diego are here. So glad you all are watching. Now, another lust moment to add a, even a little more edge. Are you ready for this pointed double buckle flat from Shoots? Get ready for it because it is so chic and fabulous. Comes in ivory as well, which by the way, I think I might actually have to buy the ivory because believe it or not, I love wearing ivory flats all through this fall transitional season. All of us need a mule for an easy transition shoe. I know we love our sneakers, but if you want to look a little dressier and you want the comfort of a flat, the mule is your answer to that. I have to convince my family members to wear open back shoes, but it's so such a relief when you start to get used to it. Clara is asking, are they comfortable? Liz is asking, are they comfortable? Well, let's put it to the shoe test. I'm going to pop off my booties and I'm going to put on my mules just for you guys because I want to give it a true test run. So you see how pretty these pointed toe boots are though? Don't forget about them. Those are shoots as well. So I love shoots footwear here on the mile. Let's look at how chic and fun. Oh, so fun. These are so easy, pointed, chic, but even with my pencil skirt right there, it's still looking flattering and fun. But picture it with the jean, which is where I'd be much more likely to pop it on. And it's just such an easy, go-to, edgy flat. So let me give it a comfort test. I would definitely recommend true to size on these. Definitely because they are more narrowed and pointed in the front. But yes, it does not pinch the toe. I feel cushion at the base. And I feel that flexible room. Like I can go like this in them. And I, so you would think with the buckles and the studs that it might prevent that. Liz is saying into those studs. Uh, still super, actually, let me, you know what? Maybe I should put some of these fashions down for a minute so that we can really give these shoes a true test run. So I'm gonna put my bag on the chair here for a minute and give it a flex feel, okay? So it still has a little bit of flexibility there. So even though it's like super soft, cozy, uh, kind of feeling leather on the top there. And by the way, these are a genuine leather with that double buckle. Uh, you are looking at a genuine leather flat here for under 150 with code Jackie 20. And I'm gonna keep reminding you of that amazing code. And these are sizes five through 11, size true or even a half size up. So you have that room and these are adjustable buckles. They are functional buckles. So look at how edgy and dressy a flat can be in my hands for fall. So perfect. Don't be afraid also of mixing 
silver and gold hardware finishes of your of your pieces no problem with that you can mix your metals absolutely like never an issue just like white after labor day there are no issues with that liz is saying can i work those into the winter it depends on where you live and if you live somewhere warm and sunny year round liz i'm gonna be very jealous of you but yes i think as long as my rule is as long as there's no snow on the ground you can rock these flats uh year round so if you're not going to walk into snow or uh, you know inclement weather then you're good in your pointed toe flat. So absolutely loving these. I'm gonna give them one more look before we go. And I'm just gonna put it on so you guys can really see the true feel of this flat. And honestly, even with my little pencil skirt here, which I would probably, I like to do it with my crop pants and my leggings and all those kinds of things. I am absolutely in love with these buckle flats for your casual looks. So a jeans best friend for fall right there. So be sure to check those out in your little shopping bubble there don't forget at the bottom or the right side of your video as i put my booties back on uh you can click at any time during these shows to actually shop not miss out and you can still keep talking fashion with us so let me pop my booty back on and i'm really something else i want to point out about comfort is i'm so comfortable in my rib knit two-piece look here it's so stretchy and lightweight and comfortable but just that little bit of coziness uh going into your fall and winter season so again coming in red and black such a fun look that you really definitely should own because you could even just rock it with sneakers and a denim jacket right now or even a little bomber jacket and keep it super casual as well a two-piece rib set right right now skirt set super super crisp and fun and fresh and forward so definitely get in on the fun here. Okay, now we're not done. We're gonna get into a lot more fun that I wanna talk to you about. If you guys wanna go into the blazer trend, I'm gonna have to take a temporary break from my love of my life, Alice and Olivia jacket here. By the way, it's called the Krishna cropped moto. It is a cropped vegan moto right here with all the beautiful buckle details, the gold zips, the croc emboss finish. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. So don't forget about Moto Life, as Ronnie is saying, as I take it off, uh, because I'm going to give it a temporary break while I try on my blazer trend. But know that this is the love of my life of this show right now. It is this Moto. Okay. So we're going to put her down for a second and we're going to get into blazers, which we know suiting and all of those kinds of trends have been a major trend for a while now. But when we get into fall, the scene of, I'm gonna move the tag out of the way for a second. The scene of blazers kind of changes with the tides each and every season, right? So the blazer trend right now is getting back into the oversized, back into the boxy. We've seen the shacket trend, which is the shirt meets the jacket. The blazers are getting sort of back into that oversized vibe. So this, even while, Although it's tailored, this a vegan leather blazer for this season is going to be your luxury upgrade. And actually, I love the fact that this is from Splendid. It is uh, so much more affordable than many of the other leather blazers that you're going to see out there. Again, code Jackie20 will give you even more of a discount. But just know it comes in black and oat. Of course, I'm loving showing it with my creamy ivory look going on right here but just know that you can obviously score it in black for an absolute go-to must-have kind of look but we're starting to see the return of those sort of oversized boxy blazers for fall so this i would be a i would rock a small in this and uh jm is saying i love that color leather it's really flattering it's really fun it's called oat and it plays off of those ivory neutrals but what I want to show you you could do with this is that uh, Ronnie's saying, bring on the boy boxy blazers. Yes, Ronnie, let's bring them on. Allie is saying the white dress is stunning with that oversized jacket. By the way, these are separates. It's a cropped uh, separate look here. So you're getting two for one right there. Uh, they, they are sold separately, by the way. But the mock neck rib uh, knit turtleneck and that comfy rib knit pencil skirt, you can rock these separates together apart however you so prefer. But did you see what happened when the boxy blazer went on the shoulders? It just added that workwear finish, that polished vibe, that touch of luxe. It is vegan, so you don't even have to worry about that as well. But this would look so chic and cool with whether you do it in black or 
not. I kind of like the idea of mixing my leathers. You see on my cover page that I love mixing leathers and colors. Check out this wide leg faux leather. And I know everybody's calling it vegan now to make it sound fancy, but I say faux leather still. Is that okay? Uh, I think it's fine. Look at this wide leg faux leather crop pant from Splendid. Amazing. It is workwear elevated at its finest. I'm so obsessed with the idea of a full on vegan leather suit look. So you could do it in the black, but how much fun is it to do an oat colored blazer with the black colored faux leather pant? You can rock this pant with your tank and heels and it could be a going out look. You can make it work wear chic. You could do a striped crisp blouse, a white crisp blouse and equally stunning with a flat to make it sort of crisp and casual. Picture a button down shirt with this flat with this cropped pant and you're having a moment. So many ways to have fashion moments. That's why I'm calling these the fall wardrobe staples because you're gonna be able to mix and match these pieces, any one of them, into your wardrobe in so many ways throughout fall and winter alike. So check out this wide leg crop pant now in your shopping bubble. If you're as excited as I am, it, it operates like a true trouser look, which is a little bit of a switch up from the vegan leather legging, which I do have for you as well for under 100 coming up next. But this to me is such a fun workwear update and a way to look workwear and suit it up, even if you're a blogger, influencer, creator, whatever you want to call yourself and you don't have an office, you're, the world is your office. It's still a great chic workwear look, no matter what your work is. And don't forget, you could do the heel. You could do the strappy ankle sandal. You could do your pointed flat. You could do a booty. There's so many fun ways uh, to mix it all together. So check this one out. Uh, again, it's the vegan leather ankle trouser sizes zero through 14. So let's talk about sizes for a minute because I would normally be, and I actually just recently said this to someone, I said, I'm always a four, four to six even in pants because I like to have room. And believe it or not, these are a zero and they fit super well. So this, I would say size down. Splendid is generous with their sizing. So I'd even probably be a two sometimes in Splendid. These are even a zero. So they come in zero through 14. You can definitely size down uh, because you do have a little bit of that wide leg to work with. I think it's to your benefit to try a size down and see if it works for you. That's just my opinion. But of course, do as you wish. True to size, you can never go wrong. But it gives you polish. It gives you edge. It gives you that sense of tailoring to mix with your blazer, with your pan here. The crop, that's why I say that crop uh, rib knit mock neck top is such a great staple piece for all of these fall looks. You need a staple tank. This is such a great sta staple tank with the gold button finish there to make it a little fancy. But any version of this is such a must have. So just reminding you of all these must have pieces. So whether you do this with your leggings, with your suits, with your jeans, all that good stuff, even with a dress, now, let's get into a different version of the blazer trend. This is now taking us into, and I see guest 341 is saying, gorgeous, thank you. I'm, I'm thinking you're talking about the clothes, and they are gorgeous, and I'm loving all of them. But let's talk about a totally different vibe with a statement blazer now for fall. This is answering and bringing in all of those pumpkin spice latte lovers out there, all of those chic equestrian fall leaves falling, uh, you know, knee high brown boots wearing, ready to go for fall moments. It, don't you just feel the plaid coming through for all of those apple picking, uh, you know, all of those things that are so fally, at least here in New York. Uh, this is that to me, an ode to fall and such a fun way to do a statement blazer Hello plaid, hello browns, uh, you know, warm cognac tones. This is such a fun, uh, eye-catching pop of plaid that I love that you could take it into the Western trend. You could take it into that sort of London-y vibe. You can make it uh, very European chic and cool. You can make it super casual and easy with the jean, of course. Look at how fun that becomes with the white boot the jean, the tank, and the blazer. It is, Liz is saying, yes, so fall. So let me give you the details on this one. This is the, uh, hold on, let me find it, the Ricky, the Ricky plaid blazer. Now this one 
actually cuts a little bit more oversized, so you could definitely size down in this one. Liz is saying, love that it's casual. Is it warm? Yes, it has that. It definitely gives you that fleecy feel to the fabric. It's definitely that warmer feeling blazer. So it could act as a jacket depending on where you are. You could throw on a wool hat, sunglasses, give it the whole shebang. And of course, you can mix it in even with black. It still looks so chic. I love pairing neutrals together. But this is the Ricky Plaid blazer in sizes extra small through extra large. And it is under 200. It is a great pickup. It does actually come in navy as well. But to me, this is a statement for fall. It is like that piece you're looking for. If you want to read fall vibes, there it is. It's giving you that. Now, I'm showing it with a jean as I hold it up. But look at how different it becomes if I were to pair it with a skinny leather legging. You can make it super luxe and super elevated and chic and dressy with something like a vegan leather legging, which, by the way, these are under 100, must have under 100 and even less with code Jackie 20, but they come in a cognac sort of dark, rich espresso brown as well. So check out the different colors. I believe they also come in almost like a nude uh, type of leather look as well. The under 100 must have of the show right here, multiple colorways, the immediate staple when you want to have that elevated legging, you don't want it to look too athleisure or like you're just rolling out for casual errands. This is going to be the elevated vegan leather legging in your wardrobe you will wear so many times on end and I'm rocking the small in them. They fit me perfect. So check out for your sizing what will work for you. But I can't tell you enough how you need this in your closet to throw it on with a sweater. Uh, it's that tumbled vegan leather, extra small through extra large. It has that wide high waistband there. It's such an easy staple with a denim shirt, with your jackets, with you know your turtlenecks, your cozy knits. That brings me to something else I wanna show you. And we're in plaid right now, but we have to start adding some stripes to our life as well. Look at how fun that is with a striped sweater and the one that I'm holding in my hand, which is so amazing. It's such a, another love of mine uh, for fall right here. This is from Solid and Striped. It is an amazing, heavy knit, cropped striped sweater. So the possibilities are endless. Again, with all of this fall pairing here, I'm like running out of room to, to create outfit ideas. I'm gonna, I could go on all day, uh, but my live stream has to end sometime. So I'm gonna keep moving here, but I, I would like you to score any of these pieces and see what kind of fun you can have mixing and matching them together. So check all of these pieces out. Let me know in the chat, which ones you're loving. So can we go back to this amazing statement sweater right here? And you know what? I'm even gonna throw it on, on top of my rib knit. Now, so here's where sizing is just so interesting because I love the idea, if it's a crop, to go oversized because this is a medium. And because it's cropped, it gives such a fun oversized vibe to it where I can easily, of course, fit the small. But I love the idea of having, having room to work with and having it feel just comfy and cozy and plush. So giving it that size up, immediately just gives it makes it look even more rich and luxe and expensive so i like the idea of sizing up in your crop sweaters medium i'm, I'm rocking it right here but how fun is this styling idea because we haven't gotten into any dresses for someone who says i love dresses you could go from the leather legging you could go into the jean but the unexpected twist that all of our sort of influencer style fashionistas out there are doing is say hello to the slip dress. Pair your sweater with a slip dress today. I highly recommend it. It is such an easy layering look. So I would throw on this slip dress underneath this sweater and it's, it's casual meets dressy. And it's something that we're seeing all over the place as such a fun layered look. So, so many ways to rock your statement sweater this season for fall. And this is a sweater that you're gonna have for seasons and seasons to come. But don't forget, when it comes to fall dresses, I'm probably gonna do a whole show about fall dresses, but don't forget your slip. Don't forget your slip dress. Make sure it's a real dress. Don't actually go out in a slip, but it's hard to tell the difference these days. And this is a luxury silk satin one from Paige that you'll see in the shopping carousel. You could feel the luxe 
of this satiny slip dress right here. It's sort of uh, double like layered when you feel it. It's like a double layer silk satin, 100% silk. And what I like about this one is it has a beaded halter neck detail. So you really know it's a real dress. And you can actually even wear this with gold heels and make it dressy for a wedding as a wedding guest. There's so many things you could do with your slip dress. So when it comes to your fall style staple dress, say hello to the slip. It's been around, whether you do a slip skirt, slip dress, it's, it's really making its way into our layering. Can I, can I kind of give you the idea? You layer it like that and it just looks so fun and chic and cool. And you wear sneakers, you wear your boots and you go on your merry way in comfort and style all in one. So definitely don't be afraid to work this layer in. You could finish it off, of course, with a polished blazer, or can we go back to my love for motos? In fact, when I was expecting with both of my sons, one of my favorite looks was to pair your slip dress with your moto jacket, and you could pretty much go just about anywhere in chic edgy style so so much layering fun to be had for fall i could go on all day about it but i'm hoping you guys are enjoying these amazing pieces and we'll see some of them go into your closet as a staple i have a couple more to go because we haven't gotten into the classic the denim dress if you're looking at these staple dresses you're seeing that i'm going with the classics here this staple dress from seven for all mankind is so incredible. Why? Because it has this denim luster finish. It's called the denim luster collection. And what this does is it feels and looks actually looks like that true rigid denim, but it feels like the softest lyocell fabric ever of life. And so while it looks true rugged denim, it is the softest hand feel that you could ever imagine because it's actually a lyocell fabric. So when you need a one and done statement dress for your go-to for fall that you could wear in a million ways to one with boots, with sneaks, with heels, here you go. This is a true pocketed, belted, functional button denim dress from Seven for, for All Mankind. You'll see that one as a shoppable option as well. So again, another beautiful, rich denim finish for fall. I love all the pocket details, the buttons, those crisp silver buttons really give a lot of pop. You could wear it a little bit open and even leave a couple at the bottom open to give it a self-created kind of slit look, but absolutely loving this functional denim dress. I would actually pop something like this on with sneakers to go drop my son off at school and then go wear it in the city and be completely dressy about it. So another workhorse right here for your fall wardrobe staples. And I'm going to close things out on that silky satin trend where we saw with our slip dress with the statement white blouse. This one from Allison, New York, one of my fave brands here on the mile. Look at how beautiful the crystal button details are. When I say you need that crisp white blouse, this is taking it and giving it a vintagey statement blouse vibe. It's a silky satin finish, which we're seeing trending a lot for fall. Puff sleeve detail here. Again, those crystal buttons to really give it a vintagey finish, tailored vibe. You could rock this as a staple piece. Again, with your leggings, with your jeans, throw on that beautiful moto blazer. And again, you have just another crisp, easy go-to fall outfit. So whether you go for a clean white blouse, that new jean, that luxe, beautiful moto that is my lust object right here there's so many ways your new sweater your skirt set there's so many fun ways blazer trend to amp up your style for fall i can't wait to hear how you guys will all do that and i hope some of these pieces help don't forget you can shop with the exclusive discount code Jackie20, this is the series where affor affordable fashion meets high fashion on the mile, the app where you can shop your favorite brands from your favorite influencers and creators all in one place. And I will be back here in this same place next Thursday at 3 p.m. talking even more fall fashion with you. So I hope you have fun and have a good shopping for the uh, experience. I hope you shop and have something, shop something fun. Share it with me on social media, guys, if you do from this show or just scroll, do as you wish, but I wish you happy shopping and I'll see you next week. Bye guys.